play cricket. That's the chip it that we went into thousands of times in there. I used to go in there nearly every day. Fish and chips, me and Jill. Now, you come down Dalton Green Lane, yeah. all the trees were elms and they all died. There were huge trees here, 40 foot trees. Yeah, and they all dried. They were all, all the way down here. This, this is the top of our Greenlee Road, the top of our street. Yeah, we knew everybody that lived in this street. And this is the street that we were brought up in. Now, the only people I know that's still left here is Mr. and Mrs. Mann. And unfortunately, Mr. Mann has just died. Mrs. Mann, I bet she's sat up seat in there. No, she's not. not Mrs. Mann there. The Sellenses, it's amazing to come back here. The Sellenses, who had four children who became very, very successful, lived at number 15. God, it does look different. Crikey, lived there. Wow, doesn't it look different? I don't know, Ron, I've never been here. Yeah, it certainly does. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Now, on the... Oh, are they stripping it? And I mean... Now, we're at number 20, we should be number 27. Yeah. And there should be a huge tree in the back, in the back, unless they've knocked it down. Is that... It's that one, isn't it? It's that one. That's where we, that's where we used to. And oh, the wall is still there. Oh, this this wall is amazing. Can you see that brick wall there? Yeah. There, that brick wall. Yeah. That brick wall there. Right. Yeah. There's a, an amazing story about that brick wall. Uh, my mother wanted, when she first moved in, wanted a, a, a boundary wall, and this man came and said, "Yeah, you were a brick, eh?" Uh, but he couldn't afford to buy the materials to build the wall and so my mother paid him 40 pounds this is before the war mm -hmm. paid him 40 pounds to have that wall built yeah and uh, it's still there now and it's still as good as new it's slightly fallen down let's just have a look see if the tree is there the tree was there last time last time I went this is where all the Allen lads Oh. Oh. Is, it, is it still there? Oh, come on, look. Ron, you can't just walk. Of course I can, I'll knock on the door and ask if I can come in. So, this is Dad's old house. They charge 400 quid to do that? Yeah. They haven't even cut it down, they've just trimmed it. Yeah. <laughs> well, it was, uh, it, was at, it was at least 90 foot high. So this wasn't here, obviously, when you when you did. Pardon? Was this here? No. No, no there, was, That's, there was, that? was a shed there. None of this was here, this extension. There was a goal hole here, that's all. There was a shed there. And the garden used to be looked after slightly better. Wonderful. <laughs> Mr. Mellie used to live here. Jim, there's the call though. Look, there's a call below. There, you see that call all there? Yep. There used to be one here. Well, we used to. Have, every one of them had one. That I bet that's the only one that's left. We used to jump off there. Didn't you used to pole vault off it or something? Yeah. And I got I got Terry Rapson to pole vault off it, and he broke his arm in seven places. <laughs> he finished up, hung on the pole like this, <laughs> and he, he, he come, hit the pole was stuck and he stuck vertically, and he dared he dare come down. <laughs> Damn. And all, all the houses are falling down that way. They're all falling down. Even the even the point in is still is still there. The cement. He must have done it really well. 
to say that it's already been played on. When I, when I sold it, sorry, when I bought it off my brother Alan, yeah, whatever date it was, I can't remember, he said, oh, would I buy it off him? And he wanted 2,200 for it. And then a year later, I said I'd buy it. He wanted 3,300 for it. So I bought it for 3,300. Come on, let's go, or I'll start crying.